Hello, friends. We are spending a fun day at the pool, and I am helping the lifeguard while he has gone on a break. I need to be alert while on duty. So Luffy, Tippy, and Iggy will take you through this lesson. In today's lesson, we will be learning about perpendicular lines. When two lines meet and form a right angle, the lines are called perpendicular lines. They are perpendicular to each other. When two perpendicular lines meet, they always form a right angle. Like this one. Let us give names to the lines so it's easier to understand. Line AB is perpendicular to line XY. The two lines meet at the point B. Here we can see right angles formed on either side. Have you noticed the sign that denotes perpendicular lines? In this image, AB is perpendicular to XY. Let's use a square grid paper to see some examples of perpendicular lines. In picture one, a right angle is formed when the two lines meet. Hence, these are perpendicular lines. In picture two, although the two lines meet, they do not form a right angle. Therefore, the two lines in this picture are not perpendicular. Let's check out some more examples around us. Corner of the swimming pool. A book. A window. A photo frame. The swimming float. Perpendicular lines can also run through a point. If I draw a line through point X to meet line AB, that is also a perpendicular line. lifeguards at the swimming pool is looking out for? The lifeguard at a swimming pool has to be very attentive and keep an eye out for anyone in trouble. They also ensure that the facilities at the public pools are not being misused. During weekends and holidays, public pools can get very crowded. We should all behave responsibly and make sure we follow the rules and not become a nuisance to anyone. Oh, the lifeguard is back on duty. Now time for me to relax in the pool. Don't forget to do the short quiz before you decide to relax. 